Welcome, my friend, to the channel of Wise Jack. Of the tale of Antoine de Saint Exupéry and Consulo Sunsin. It's the story that whisks us away on a magic carpet woven with threads of romance, turbulence, and a touch of literary genius. Let's set our time machine to the early 1930s and land in the heart of their saga. Antoine de Saint Exupéry, whom you might know as the author of The Little Prince, was not just a writer, he was also an aviator. A man who danced with the clouds and flirted with the stars. But little did he know, his heart was about to be hijacked, not by a damsel in distress, but by a fiery Salvadoran artist and writer named Consulo Sunsin. She wasn't just any ordinary woman. No, she was a widow of a former comrade of Saint Exupéry, and a whirlwind of a personality, capable of making even the wildest rose seem tame. Their first encounter was something of a plot twist. They met in Buenos Aires, where Saint Exupéry was taking a breather from his AML pilot duties. It was love at first sight, or perhaps love at first flight. They married in 1931, but hold your horses, this wasn't your fairy tale wedding. It was a union marked by Saint Exupéry's frequent absences and Consulo's tempestuous nature. Now, let's talk about their love. It was the kind that could inspire a thousand sonnets and yet be the subject of gossip columns. They were passionately in love, but their relationship was as turbulent as a stormy night in the Sahara. Senti Zupiri, in his travels, would often be away, leaving Consilo lonely, which led her to have affairs. Yes, you heard it right. Affairs. Meanwhile, Saint Exupéry wasn't exactly a saint either. He too sought comfort in the arms of other women. But here's a twist. Despite their fiery arguments and mutual infidelities, they shared a bond that was unbreakable. Consulo was not just Saint Exupéry's wife. She was his muse, his north star, guiding him through his darkest nights. She was the rose to his little prince, the inspiration behind the famous character in his most celebrated work. It's said that her demand for attention and care was what inspired the needy, unique rose on the little prince's asteroid. Their story, like a classic novel, doesn't have a happy ending. In 1944, during a reconnaissance mission in World War II, Saint Exupéry vanished without a trace over the Mediterranean Sea. Consulo was left with a heartache that would last a lifetime. Their love story was a roller coaster of emotions, a testament to the complexities of human relationships. It teaches us that love is not just about the sunny days, but also about navigating through the storms together. And, just like the little prince, their story reminds us that it is only with the heart that one can see rightly. What is essential is invisible to the eye. That is all for today, folks. It would be nice of you to give me thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.